Hi, and welcome to this Majestic Cloud video. My name is Laszlo Bodor and I will show you today how to set up a static website in an Amazon S3 bucket. I will also show you how to uh, configure your domain name in Route 53 to point to this uh, static website. So, let's get started. The first thing we need to do is to create a bucket. Uh, this bucket needs to have the same name as your domain name. So I've registered the uh, domain name uh, and uh, set it up in uh, Route 53. Uh, I mean, the registration is done there, but um, uh, I will show you how to create later the uh, settings for the um, static website in uh, Route 53. But first, let's create the bucket. So as I said, it needs to have the same uh, name as my uh, domain name. Uh, in this case, playground.majestic.cloud. Okay, so we go to the next page, leave everything as it is, go to the next page, and here we need to make sure to uncheck this block all public access. So why is that? That is because uh, we need uh, our website to be public so people can access the documents on it. So uh, if we would leave this uh, checked, it would block all public access and our uh, site wouldn't be available for everyone. So this is it uh, on the bucket creation side. Uh, let's create the bucket. Okay, here it is, playground.majestic.cloud. Let's go um, <coughs> inside the bucket and um, configure some things. First of all, uh, we go to the permissions tab and we need to create a bucket policy. This is a policy document we need to create. Uh, for that, I will uh, copy the Amazon resource name for this bucket and go here to the policy generator, open it in a new tab, uh, go to that tab and then OK. Uh, here we select S3 bucket policy effect allow principle will be everything um, here we need to select the get object uh, permission because we want to allow people to get objects from our uh, bucket uh, here we paste the amazon resource name we just copied on, from the bucket page and uh, we need to add the star at the end um, backslash and the star okay um, it looks okay let's add this statement and generate the policy so this is the policy document uh, we need to copy this and go back to the uh, bucket policy edit editing page uh, paste the policy here and click on save so uh, as we saved you see that uh, the public sticker appeared our uh, bucket is, has now public access, everything we upload inside is public. So let's go back to the overview and upload our website. So in this case I've created a very basic uh, website, it only has an index HTML and an error HTML. The index will be the, the home page and the error document will be displayed if um, um, the page the user is looking for is not found. So let's upload this. Um, this is uploaded. Okay. We now need to go to the properties tab uh, and go to the static website hosting. And we need to enable this, use this bucket to host the website. And we need to specify our index document. This will be the index HTML, as I just said. And we need an error document. Here it will be error HTML. So we click on save and our static website hosting is enabled. Um, S3 generated for us uh, uh, URL. Uh, if we go to this, uh, basically, um, this is it. Um, this is our website. Um, you can see it's a very basic one. And um, it's accessible by this auto-generated uh, URL. Now what we want to do is to configure a domain name for this uh, and we need to go to Route 53. So here we are in Route 53. Um, we need to create... Uh, I have only one hosted zone, I go inside it and create a record set. Um, 
this will be an A record and it will need to be an alias type this is something specific to AWS and here we already have our website endpoints appearing so we choose the one we just created playground.majestic.cloud then we click on create so uh, we have the A record and usually it takes a bit of time to propagate it depends on your configurations and uh, how lucky you are uh, so uh, let's try it out <coughs> I will open a new tab and click inside and you can see that our uh, static website is, is, is working so basically this is it this is how you create a, a simple um, static website with Amazon S3 and uh, Amazon Route 53 if you have a domain so I hope you liked this video if you liked it uh, then please click on the like button and subscribe to the channel and I hope to see you again soon in another Majestic Cloud video